All right, everyone, Lauren and Elisa at Roaring River State Park in Cassville. You know they stock the rainbow trout, one of the most popular parks out there in the Midwest. Good morning, guys. What have you caught so far for me? We haven't caught anything, but we made a friend who did. Uh, this is Charles Shaw, who's visiting all the way from Kansas. From Kansas, near the Lawrence area, and he's already got two trout sitting in here. And do, do you got one on the line right now? How's it no, going? No, I missed him there. <laughs> We've been distracting <laughs> him a little bit. Break that time. So. <laughs> That's okay. Tell us why you come from Kansas to come to Roaring River. Well, usually it's pretty great fishing, and this trip down, it was to bring grandsons down. I got four grandsons. Aww. And they're scattered so, along the shoreline, oh, right? Oh, yeah, they, they're like a threw a hand grenade. They took <laughs> off this morning, so and you said up and down this yeah, thing. Yeah, so. yesterday you said you were busy baiting lines for them all day. Yeah, yesterday was the first day down, and I went through uh, probably about two dozen rooster tails yesterday morning. <laughs> It was all I could do to keep them baited up and oh. everything. But this morning they haven't come back yet, so I think we must be doing pretty oh, good. Oh, you're going to have a I feast got, then yeah. later. Yeah, I've got all the bait and all right here with me, so oh my so gosh. he must be doing okay this morning. So well, that's great to see, and very sweet of you to help him out with that. Uh, so and for chatting with us too. Yes. Well, you're, you're <laughs> yeah. So. Good luck. Soon we'll leave you alone so you can catch some more trout. Uh, this is just the first stop of the day for us, though, right? Yeah. I mean, we've got a jam-packed day after we head out of here with more trout. We're going to the smallest chapel in the world in Mount Vernon. Yeah, so we're excited to see that. We've heard that you can fit only a select few people in there. So be I don't thinking think I'll about have a problem though. <laughs> you don't think so? <laughs> well, be thinking about, I, I'm interested. I want to know if people had to get married there, who their people would be that they'd invite. Oh, good point. That they can squeeze in there. So and how busy it is for booking. Yes, that's happening. <laughs> uh, we're also going to Osceola later today, too, to yeah. see a rat and some cheese. Yeah, really, really cool. Yeah. Cheese factory. And then so we'll end up do some uh, tasting. Yeah, we'll end up pretty close to home, actually, in Stratford. So that's a little bit of what our day looks like today. I think we might actually do some fishing since we learned how when we caught our lunch yesterday. Yeah, two days in a row now that we've done some trout fishing. They don't have Italian bread for the bait here, though, so it might be a little bit harder for us. Um, yeah. But yeah, so we've got a jam-packed day. We'll have lots coming up on social media. Yeah. We'll send it back to you, Joe. <laughs> All right. True dedication from Charles. He's barely even stopping fishing to talk to you ladies right there. Oh, no, of course not. He so he says you're you're busy. You're not. You're you're busy and you keep going. Do you have another one yet? No, no. <laughs> not yet. He's catching oh, him for yeah. the wife. <laughs> All right. Thanks guys. We'll keep checking up with you guys throughout the day. Colors after you throw to him so much, it seems like you need to change the color. He can give lessons right there. We'll check back up with them later on. Stay with us.